go. Oh yeah. Well, we got the skunk out of the boat. That's fish number one, any way you look at it. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with something like that. Pretty fish, not a mark on him. Sure isn't. And, uh, circle hook got him right where it was supposed to. Number one. Yeah, he's a nice fish. Yeah, there we go. That's the first one. We'll get him back in there and hopefully they'll start getting a little bigger for us. Alright. Ryan, what kind of what kind of rig are you using here? Well, what we're using here is a sliding sliding weight deal. I've got a lighter weight. Uh, line down to my, my weight here. We got about 40 pound test, 80 pound uh, braided mon or, uh, main line uh, down to an 80 pound leader to an eight dot double action hook. Now, what size leader you you normally run on them? A 80 pound, especially when we're fishing around all these rocks. Well, as far as length, what is length? length? Um, I like any anything from about 18 inches to about three foot, especially when we're. We're not, it, it, this current looks like it's real heavy, but underneath we've got a pretty good drop off, so there's not a lot of current down towards the bottom. So I like to, especially in that lighter current, I like to go to a little bit longer bit of a leader. It gives the bait a little bit of action, and uh, you know, it seems, seems to catch more fish. But, um, you know, run a, run a longer leader on that sliding weight, and uh, especially when you're fishing around these rocks, you wanna make sure that your, your drop line to your weight is uh, a lighter pound test. We're running 40 here and 80 on our main line. So, so you've got two barrel swivels. You got a barrel swivel running from your main line to your leader line. Mm-hmm. And then uh, a barrel swivel. Yeah, nothing fancy. I mean, you can put a stopper or something like that or a bead uh, to protect that knot. Um, you know, up here today, we're going to be breaking off so much that it's really, we're not going to keep rigs long enough to, to worry about busting that knot up. So, um, you know. Just, just kind of keeping it simple today and doing anything crazy, but um, just you know, kind of throwing it out there, fanning it out here. We're fishing some pretty shallow water and um, you know, waiting for them to come to us, kind of old school catfishing, but uh, it's a lot of fun when they jump on there.